Beneath alien skies, 443 million years ago, our planet bore little resemblance to the familiar world we know today. The Landovery stage marked the crucial dawn of the Silurian period, a transformative time when continents drifted across vast oceans. Massive ice sheets had recently retreated from polar regions, finally ending one of Earth's most devastating mass extinction events in history. Rising sea levels flooded the low-lying continents extensively, creating shallow tropical seas that stretched across ancient landmasses worldwide. In these remarkably warm, crystal-clear waters, life began its truly remarkable recovery from near-total annihilation and widespread devastation. Primitive jawless fish, closely resembling modern lampreys, glided silently through the nutrient-rich waters, constantly searching for available food sources. Massive coral reefs began steadily forming in the shallow seas, built by ancient marine organisms called tabulate corals. Trilobites, those truly iconic armored arthropods, scuttled across the muddy sea floor despite their greatly diminished numbers from extinction. Giant sea scorpions, some reaching impressive lengths of eight feet, dominated the marine ecosystem as fearsome apex predators. Brachiopods anchored themselves firmly to rocky surfaces, efficiently filtering microscopic organisms from the constantly flowing ocean currents. Crinoids, or sea lilies, swayed gracefully in the gentle currents, their delicate feathery arms capturing drifting plankton particles. The first jawed fish were gradually evolving, fundamentally revolutionizing predator-prey relationships in these ancient marine environments forever. Graptolites floated peacefully in vast colonies near the ocean surface, their remarkably delicate structures eventually preserved as fossils. On the barren land, the very first simple plants began tentatively colonizing the harsh continental surfaces near ancient shorelines. Primitive mosses and liverworts formed thin but persistent green carpets along the muddy edges of primordial lakes and streams. The atmosphere contained significantly higher carbon dioxide levels, creating a powerful greenhouse effect that consistently warmed the planet. Volcanic islands dotted the expansive oceans, continuously spewing ash and lava that would eventually form entirely new continental landmasses. Ancient mountain ranges rose dramatically from the sea floor as massive tectonic plates collided with tremendous geological force. Stromatolites, built by colonies of cyanobacteria, formed distinctive layered mounds in the shallow waters of warm tropical lagoons. The supercontinent Gondwana dominated the southern hemisphere, while smaller landmasses drifted slowly across the northern latitudes. Ocean chemistry was gradually changing as diverse life forms began producing more oxygen through photosynthesis than ever before. Reef ecosystems expanded rapidly and extensively, providing essential shelter and food for an ever-increasing diversity of marine creatures. The Landovery stage witnessed life's truly incredible resilience as biodiversity slowly but steadily recovered from mass extinction. These ancient seas laid the fundamental foundation for all complex ecosystems that would eventually follow in Earth's history.